Hello everybody, it's Zach here from realestatelicensewizard.com. Today we are going over another real estate math practice question. If you're new here in this series, we cover real estate math questions that are likely to show up on the real estate exam. If you have any math questions you want me to cover, you can drop them down below and they may be featured in a future video. Now, if you wanna try real estate math questions at yourself, as well as regular real estate exam questions, go ahead and check out our website, realestatelicensewizard.com. Now this series and our channel as a whole has been just a great study experience for everyone included. So make sure to click the like button and subscribe. That way you're fully prepared come exam day. Anyways, let's jump right into it. So this week, today, yesterday, all this week, we're talking about real estate commission. So commission splits, uh, basic commission problems, finding out commission, uh, total prices for houses, using commission percentages, all that good stuff. So stay tuned for that. All right, so let's jump into today's question. All right, so it says, during the listing agreement, a commission of 6% is established. The house is sold for $450,000. What is the commission? And it gives us four options. A, $4,500. B, $27,000. C, $45,000. D, $270,000. $100,000. So as always, I'm going to go ahead and give you guys an opportunity and some time to pause here, think it over, come up with your answer. So go ahead and do that right now. All right, if you guys need more time here, feel free to pause. Uh, I'm gonna jump into the answer. So what's our answer gonna be for this one? Well, it's going to be B, that's right, it's this $27,000. So how did we get that? Well, uh, this one's a pretty straightforward one. Don't be confused. And that's why I'm doing all these commission problems because again, as I mentioned like in yesterday's video, it's like a building block. Like you can have these different blocks in these questions that make them harder or easier if they take these blocks away. So this is a pretty straightforward commission problem. All you're gonna do here is you're gonna take that $450,000, which again is what the house sold for. And then you're going to multiply that by the commission rate because it's just asking what is the commission. Uh, it's not asking, you know, what the specific agent got. It's not asking about commission splits, anything complicated. It's a pretty straightforward, what is the commission problem? So after that, again, we're going to be taking that 0.06 or that 6%. We're going to be multiplying that by that $450,000. And what is that going to give us? Well, it's going to be getting us the $27,000, which of course is our answer and which is B. So don't be confused with these ones. If it seems straightforward, most likely it's a straightforward uh, question. Just make sure you read it thoroughly. Make sure you read it all the way through. And of course, ask yourself, what is this question actually asking? Well, it's asking, what is the commission? So we know that uh, and we do that and then we get our answer. All right, guys, if you enjoyed, give us a thumbs up, subscribe for more if you're new to the channel, all that good stuff. Again, we're sticking with commission all week this week. So stay tuned for more. I'm hoping you guys are experts by the end of this week on commission and you'll be able to knock it out of the park come exam day. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Zach from realestatelicensewizard.com. Make today magical. I'll see you next time.